In this video, I'm going to show you Eden CapCut text tricks. No one is talking about this is a CapCut tutorial. You don't want to miss because it's going to elevate the way you use text on CapCut. It's a very simple tutorial. I'm going to show you two ways. I'm going to show you how to use text with effect properly and how to use text with amnation. So for this, I'm going to bring in my text and this is a text box I'm going to be using. So I'm going to be using this word subscribe. If you've not subscribed to my channel and you're watching me for the first time, then this is the best time to do it. Now let's first go to effect. So if we go to effect, usually when you bring in your effect, it's going to affect the old clip. Like for instance, let's use this effect here. If I drag it in, you can see I can't place it on my text directly. I can do that. I have to put it on top and me putting it on top. This is the effect it gives me. So I'm going to show you another one. This is affecting the old video, right? Yes, it's giving you that effect, but it's affecting the old image because if you also have a video under here, this effect will definitely affect it. That's not what we want. Let me do one more before I go through and show you the first trick here. Right? So now you can see this also. This is what happens is affecting the old video, not the text alone. And that's not what we want also. And if we click on this text, as you can see, we have just some few options here. You have text, you have animation, which definitely is the normal type in, type in, type out, normal animation you have with text on CapCut. But I'm going to show you how to activate an extra eating menu here which converts your video to a better version and when you use it in your video people ask how did you make your text do that how did you achieve that so let me now show you using the effects and animations so let's start with the effect tab so what you do is you click and you do your control um you do your alter g that's to co convert the text to a compound clip that is the first step and now if you look at effect you can now drag effect into the text and it's going to give you a better feel for just the text alone for this one see the way it looks now so you can see it's now in the text the effect is now in the text if we take that effect out by deleting it and putting another effect like this closing effect you just see how it's going to elevate this text for us now if i play it from beginning this is what we'll get you can see it's affecting just the text and not the whole video on the timeline super easy i'll do one more and i'll show you the next great thing about this so let's add one more effect and i'll just okay i'll use this you can use you can try other effects out for yourself after this video so let me just show you this so you can see the text is not appearing on the screen but watch when i play play are you seeing that so is that easy that is one of the way to use it the other way i will show you now is i want you to watch the tabs remember we had just about let me let me deactivate compound click undo compound clip so clicking on this you can see we had text, animation, tracking, text to speech, right? Now watch what happens once I convert it to compound clip. So now you have text, video, speech, speed, animation, tracking. Now this is the video animation instead of the normal text animation. So you are not going to see something like the typing or any other kind of animation. You are going to see the in out combos, right? So now this is where you can apply your shake like this. And this is what you get. So you can see that's what you get. So you can't do it with your normal text. You have to convert it to. And that's why I said it's a secret no one talks about or they rarely talk about. You have to convert it to a combat clip to have this effect now. And as you can see, so you can make the effect longer by increasing it here. And if you play, as you can see. If it took longer to finish, it's cool. 
you can even do that okay you can do that so let's slide from down as you can see you can also click on this it opens up from the side so you can see these are cool tricks you can do you can even adjust colors now you'll be shocked to know that once you change it you can actually add lots to the text you can actually do some really cool stuff from this menu now okay you can actually do some cool stuff so if the you can see you can see we are changing the color with just temperature and the rest with the tint saturation you can do a lot of cool things from this menu now you can do as much as you want i hope this was helpful and it didn't take you a lot of time and you're going to be trying it out now in your new videos your new edits going forward and i hope this cap cup tips and trick for text was really helpful i'll see you on the next one stay blessed